Yes, welcome to Hen House Studios Live. Today we have a special show, actually a different show. It's going to be our video show, our first video show. And we have four videos to show you today. The first one comes from Lonnie Marshall, filmed at Hen House Studios and out, in, out and about Los Angeles. Lonnie Marshall is the leader and the, and the actual person that put together the band The Weapon of Choice, which is, was a very famous band, was signed to Sony Music, uh, records about eight or nine years ago. Things didn't go quite well, but they're still around. You can still actually go and see them play. I really advise going out and checking Weapon of Choice, one of my favorite bands. Lonnie Marshall is one of the most famous bass players in the world. He's often in the top five in Bass Player, player Magazine as, as one of the top five funk bass players. He's recorded with people like Macy Gray, has written songs for Macy Gray. He's also, I don't know if you guys remember, Tone Loke had a big rap record. That's Lonnie playing bass on that as well, an extremely talented person who goes by the name of Meganaut and hangs out with Fishbone and is in that same circle of the LA funk Funketeers. Anyway, you guys about ready in there to roll the tape? Let's roll it. Okay, here we go. Lonnie Marshall, weapon of choice. My name is Lonnie Marshall. Meganaut. <laughs> Lonnie Marshall, you can call me Meganaut. I live in Hollywood, and I am a freelance musician who makes something out of nothing hair. without pushing <laughs> panic buttons. This guy's really Can I get some bread, bread for this jam? <laughs> I was fortunate enough when I was in junior high school to uh, be able to go on stage with Bootsy at the LA Coliseum at the last great funk festival in LA. When you give it up to me, you set my mind free. Free, what a wonder. Ooh, what a wonder. Bar K's, Confunction, P-Funk, Chaka Khan, Bootsy, Brides of Funkenstein, everybody. And uh, I was on stage with Bootsy with my brothers, Arik and Mario, Funketeers. And that's when I decided to get a bass and do it to you. All up in that let that cat out the bag to leave you alone might be a drag break me off son. break me break me off yeah 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 yes i enjoy the process of recording very much I'm always in the studio, and that's always where I'm at. Um, I'm always recording, and I love being in the studio, building an empire, stacking chips, and raising the stakes higher. If you give it up, sexy mama, we're gonna make you come. The Hen House is a unique 
and beautiful place. And it is a great place to record music. The Hen House. What I'm working on in the future is continuing to jam and spread the jam all across the land. The funk, the raw, uncut funk, live from LA. If you want to make it in the music business, in LA or anywhere, believe in yourself and be unstoppable, even if you ain't got no hair on top. Thanks, man. Thank you. Yes, Lonnie Marshall, Weapon of Choice. Our next band is, is related to this band, they're Trulio Disgracious, which is basically a 40-piece hip-hop orchestra that plays all over the United States, makes albums. It's actually the side project of Norwood Fisher who's the bass player from Fishbone. When you go see this band, you, you just almost never know who's going to show up. There's a, there are some core members, but there's people come out of the woodwork, incredible musicians from all over the planet. It's essentially a jam band. They never rehearse. They're constantly playing. I, I really suggest you go check them out. For those of you that like hip-hop music, this is, this is a really good way to go and funk. So let's go. You guys about ready? We're going to roll another tape. We've got Trulio Disgracious, Nord Fisher's a fishbone side, pro side project coming at you right now. Here we go. Oh, As if your train of thought has jumped the track To the rockies road of a mixed maniac Attic, attack, static, overlap, stack Up, down, over, and out of the cracks As if your train of thought has jumped the track To the rockies road of a mixed maniac I've been the hell of a state No way to relate, but wait Let me demonstrate So first I see You're heading to a tail But see the world in a blur Nothing is quite the way it seems You cannot trust the way that things occur Now your brains is bubbling Based in, in their own juices Now just brace yourself as your seatbelt loose Flying through the window Take every inflow into slivers Into pieces as your psyche releases Another milestone of murderous pain Full steam ahead, power driving to the gift of the grain We got some food for squirrels As if your train of thought has jumped the track To the rockiest road of the mixed maniac Attic attack, static, overlap, stack Up, down, over, and out of the cracks As if your train of thought has jumped the track To the rockiest road of the mixed maniac Me, the I am we, 
and the rest of us in my mental magic bus. Coming from pole position to be speaking premonition. Passed on by the persistent present condition. We are lunatic by admonition. That's why we running head first into the center of the collision. We got some food for squirrels. Down, over, and out of the cracks As if your train of thought had jumped the tracks To the rocky road, big maniac Yeah, so for, the, for those of you who noticed, that was actually Billy Bass playing guitar, who was the original and still is the bass player from the Funkadelics. He played bass on Brick House, that famous Commodore's song, one of the most incredible bass lines of all time. Moving right along, we have Fanny Franklin coming up. Fanny Franklin presently sings with Macy Gray, an incredible singer. When we met her, she's actually singing with Trulio and a lot of other bands that record at the Hen House and was not quite yet doing her own solo thing, but now she has a full-fledged solo career. Check her out, Fanny Franklin. She plays all over the place. Let's roll it, Fanny Franklin. Okay, you ready, Fanny? Yes, Ma. My name is Fanny Franklin. I always love to sing, because I've been singing in my room since I was like nine, Michael Jackson and all of that stuff. I mean, I think it was, it was really, I, I could say God felt if I really was like, gonna go there and be spiritual about it. It was just in me to sing, like to sing along with Michael Jackson or albums that were playing. But my Aunt Margie used to have a guitar and she would sing Beatles songs and I would sing along with her and we would harmonize. And the harmony was just like very inspirational to me. Harmony is beautiful. <laughs> When I was 16, I was hanging out with uh, this girlfriend of mine named A. She knew this guy named Rush, and he had an attic studio, huge attic studio. And we used to chill up there, and he would do music, and I just ended up on his album. Somehow he was making an album, and I ended up being part of that. So that was the first time I ever did anything, like, kind of on a professional level. I just put some vocals down on like six songs on the album. One of them got played on KXOU. I was like, you know, 16, 17 when that happened. It was a band called The Mumble Deep Pegs, and he did a whole album. And it was, it was cool. It was awesome. You look like Pavarotti. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Beautiful. Bravo. 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 
<laughs> See, this is a song called The Healing that we're working on right now. This is an older song. Did you bring a module? And I wrote like... He did. He wants to use our module. Eight years ago, and Fanny is bringing it back to life. He was sitting in the bottom of a trunk for a while. Not a good place for a song. Transcend this universe And you close your eyes And visualize Come to that special place When the only key Is melody, melody and harmony I find for myself, I generally hide behind other people's music, you know? I hide behind other people because I'm insecure about expressing myself, although there's something very, very definite that wants to be expressed. Whether I understand it or I like it or I think it's with the times is not necessarily the issue. I think there's something in me that wants to come out, you know? And Harlan really helped with that. People either pump me up or they like totally deflate me in just a few words, or in, in actions. They could actively not listen to what I'm doing and not care, and I become insecure and I start thinking it has some, some reflection upon myself. Or they could say, wow, that's really nice, I like that, and I could go, okay, I'm on the road, this is it, you know, this is great. People, somebody likes it, that's good enough for me. Just for somebody to say that they like something will charge me for days. Cool, perfect. <laughs> Red light fever. Yes, Fanny Franklin, incredible, incredible singer. I don't really have to give this band much of an introduction. Please, here they are. Fishbone, LA's own. Roll tape, please. Fishbone. Here we go. Not quite ready. Okay, here we go. Roll tape, Fishbone. Tower. Okay, let's do it, let's do it. Searching for the love of always says uh, But the idol of love is uncharted Well, a paradise is sitting and waiting Overflowing love and kindness Fit for many a king and queen I'm hoping for your honest And if you have one thing left that's precious to you that you have hidden away in your hideaway sack That you love very much will be taken away as well, and they won't give them. Hard to do it. In the 
times hard. Misinterpretation and misunderstanding. Uh, prepare for not a smooth but a fatal crash landing. Uh, still in the face of all of this grimace. Uh, do I be proud and tribulation? Man, I say this. Uh, keep the eye of the tiger and shine bright in the mud. Uh, over lathered up with the soap of righteousness. Uh, when surrounded deep in red tape and stress. Uh, and Babylon Bay watches you with blood and war. Uh, Turn the other way and look back no more. Uh, put on a happy face and look straight ahead. Uh, turn up the shoulders back should be the motto instead. Uh, hey, my angel, blue, not devil red. Uh, hey, blue is for alive. And red is for dead. Love will be bail. But first, there will be brimstone and hell on the thin road to agape that's treacherous. This prize was there for some, but not all of us. This is the magic mountain of heaven after a highway of hell. Yes, love will prevail. In these last days, critical times hard to deal with. You'll have to rip your heart out and save it for later. And through these times of bitterness, be a lover, not a hater, y'all. Yes, L.A.'s own Fishbone. Fishbone has been a band for over 20 years. They, they met each other in junior high school and started playing together. And I just learned today that our director, Tyrone, actually knew them growing up here in L.A. A really great band. Uh, pl you know, please go out and support this band. It's, it's really one of our, our treasures. And it would be really great if you could go out and see them. They're, they're playing all the time. Just go out and check, and check them out. Um, I don't know if you've noticed, but there's been a lot of what we call uh, cross-collaboration between these bands, you're seeing a lot of the same musicians in these clips. You know, Norwood plays with Fanny Franklin, and he plays with Trulio Disgraces, Norwood Fisher being the, the bass player in Fishbone. And I don't know if you noticed in, in one of the clips, in the Fanny Franklin clip, there was De the leader of Deca, Double G, a very important LA musician. Deca is another 40-piece hip-hop orchestra that is getting criti critical acclaim all over the world. Our next clip, I think I originally told you we have four clips, but I understand we have time for a fifth clip. This is the Skeletones. The Skeletones is another L.A. band, a ska band, that's been around for many years, about 15, 16 years. I met them through Fishbone, and it would be really great, too, if you could go out and support this band. This is a really incredible band, a very talented young singer named Jonas. Who's, it's hard to believe that the band's been together for 15 years and he's still so young because he started singing with this band when he was 14. Uh, 14 or 15 years old. And I'd just like to, to take the time to thank all the musicians for participating in the Hen House and all the viewers out there. And have a great night and roll the clip when you guys are ready. We don't know where to start the song. We don't know where to start the song. Maybe we need some bongs to smoke at it to start the song. Uh uh. Let's get busy. <laughs> <laughs>
Get you.